you believe, even if it's just the one scene, this is why it seems really important. And it's going to take, in my opinion, we like to spend four hours rehearsing that opening scene to get everybody doing the right kind of thing in the right kind of way. It is going to be an improvisation, but it's got to be structured and it's got to be worked on so it's really dynamic. And that ain't going to be done in a, an hour. So it's really important that we try to get everybody in a space so that we can work on those coming up here over the next week or so. So anyway, that's that second scene. And then the second scene, um, the third scene is, uh, is um, you know, we transition out of that scene into um, the youth worker. Um, you know, doing his work and Prior to that, let's say that the end scene is that everyone's got these tasks that they go off and do. So someone's been told to go off and do rubbish, someone's gone off to go off and do that. Um, Righteous has been told, go and book the youth centre um, for two weeks on a Friday night or whatever. And so the next scene kind of just correlates where we see Righteous come in and we go, oh yeah, we've got a booking thing on behalf of the group. So that scene, that is really where we see um, youth worker in their element, you know, talking about youth work, the history of the, the estate, um, and we're learning about, you know, where they're at with this stuff, you know, what they're still trying to do in face of all the adversity that is going on. So would the youth worker say that to Righteous? I don't know, I don't know, but what we did before, um, I think what we need to, to do is have what we did before, but make sure that you're still covering some of this stuff, um, some history within that. Yeah. Because otherwise it's just a scene of him coming in and him getting the, the win in hand because he's walked out and gone, yeah, your boy or whatever, put in the room. But somehow we want to make sure that you can still have the sense that, you know, I have been doing even though he knows. Maybe Roger could set, could set me up in the sense of he can kind of say, you've done a lot of good work here, haven't you? And then that causes me to show off a bit about it. Could be. And then we, we need to improvise it to work out what's the best way. Yeah, but that, that's what we want to get to. Yeah. We've got to get to that where you can just talk a little bit about, you know, so the audience learn that you've been doing this stuff from day dawn. Yeah. Because it's more powerful if he gets me to raise my status by showing off about all the work I've done and then he takes the piss out of me and, Brings me down. Undermines you and stuff. Mm. Then we go, we transition out of that scene into the family scene, um, where we learn, you know, stuff, what we've seen, the arrival of Zico, the conflict between the, the three of them. That's a really powerful scene. And whatever the outcomes are, because it feels like Zico's learnt that there's violence going on between his grandfather and his dad for the first time. And if we're establishing violence, We've got to do something with the violence. How does the, vi does the violence end there? Because it's the first time Zika's ever experienced the violence. Because it's been happening before Zika, while Zika was away. So if the violence is shown here, does the violence travel all the way into the show, into those end scenes? Is there going to be more violence and worse of violence down at the end of those concluding scenes? And if it does stop, why has it stopped? How has it stopped? So we've still got options on how much we might want to keep the violence. I'm not saying that you should get rid of it, but if you've opened the can of worms, you've got to deal with the can of worms. If there's a film and you watch a film and it's got a gun in it somewhere in a drawer, you know for sure by the end of the film, someone's fired that gun. So what you set up, you've got to use later on down the line. Uh, so that family seems really crucial. Um, does it bring them all together much more than they ever had been? Or does it split them apart? Now because we haven't seen the family scene, we see, we should, at 